You gonna miss Aunt Kenzie? Hey! Well, it's finally real. Um, this is gonna be the longest vlog ever because it's the longest trip ever, but uh, I feel like I haven't made a video in forever, but that's just because I've like pre-recorded everything on my main channel. So, um, I'm about to move. I'm literally, like, I'm packed. It's not big at all, but, like, somehow, I know that looks really narcissistic. I have a bag of myself. But that's a gift from Cullen. Um, yeah, it's all packed in there. I mean, like, packed. Like, super, super packed. And so, what we're going to do, hi, you know the camera's on. That's why you want to come say hi. Oh, I'm going to miss you so much. You going to miss me? Hey, I'm talking to you. Okay. And then there's Patrick. Hey! A penny on its head. He's throwing up. He's having a cat ball. Oh my god, that's a sign. Th uh, that's like the best sign ever. And it's on its head. That's wild. Like this whole vlog is gonna be like me, like bare face, like no makeup, because you guys have seen me without it already, so I'm not worried about it. And uh, look, she dressed up for the vlog. We match. I forgot what mine says though. It says, I just want to drink coffee, save animals, and take naps. That sounds about right. Mine says, fashion is my religion, which is a bit sacrilegious and blasphemous, but hey, mom bought it, so it's okay. Okay, guys, so we are in Big Spring, um, Texas right now, and we, look at this. Is this not the freakiest thing? Um, I, where were we when we started seeing them? We were it's been long. just West Texas, okay, so there, exit Big Spring. there was like a thousands and thousands and thousands of um, windmills and so I was, I've been in and out of napping and I looked at my mom and she was spooked out and then I started looking at them and then I was spooked out. So we basically are going to copyright a concept about a screenplay or something along the ideas about a sci-fi story about how freaky windmills are because I think they're freaky and they're like they're huge like massive like too 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 big so um with that being said we were trying to we've driven how long today like 10 hours uh, since 8 30 this morning. since 8 30 this morning and it's 6 p.m now so um we were gonna um uh, we were gonna try and get to el paso which is the edge of texas like the very last city really but then we decided we wanted to go chase aliens and be by area 51 so we're gonna go up and go to new mexico which is roswell new mexico and um yeah so that's kind of an update. Uh, tell me what you think about windmills because I think they look a little terrifying. So. Ooh, you zoom. Day two of being ratchet. We're in Roswell, New Mexico, and we're gonna go find aliens. And apparently, there's aliens here. And dirty snow. You used to call me on my damn phone. We're at the Roswell UFO Museum. And this says straight from Roswell, six years after the crash. We're finally in California. Look. Huh? I'm vlogging. And we're almost there. We got three and a half hours. Uh, it's Friday now, and I'm still ratchet. So. Three and a half hours, that's it. The 
this is not a warning. This is a warning. This is not a drill. They back. Looks like, it's like, hi, welcome to hell. Look at them all. We're the windmills. Just wait till they come off, till they spin off there. Uh huh, and come killing everybody. Oh! Oh, going through it. Look at that sucker spinning. <gasps> Y'all, that is freaky. Else is like that one's going real head. fast. Yeah. Look how big they are. This is all, see, see, we're in hell. That was just a warning, that was a fair warning. It's like, see you later. I'm gonna write a horror movie called The Windmill. Look at this scar on my head from sleeping like an idiot. What is this, this is like smoke fire? Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? Look at those broken down ones over there. Dun dun. You know, when Morgan comes into California, we can like put our wigs on and go to Disneyland. That's what you said. We don't have to dress up, and that'd be a good video. Good we here! It only took us forever, and look what time we're showing up at. If it shows up, you probably can't see it, but that's 11 11. That's a sign. All right, let's go do this. Okay, so it's been, it's Wednesday now, so I haven't filmed since Friday, since pulling up. And the reason is, is because I kind of felt it was a little pointless to film all of the, like, not fun stuff, like all of the, like, moving in the furniture and, like, putting furniture together, going grocery shopping and everything. So I decided I would just give you guys like a final look at everything. Here's my chalkboard wall. My mom pretty pretty much went ham on it. There's Bo Burnham. This is a Lana Del Rey quote that says, be young, be dope, be proud. There's my door. This is a painting from my friend Cheyenne that she painted for me right before I moved here. This says, life imitates art. Um, this is my living room, which you can kind of see it. There's my straight out of Compton pillow because it's like my favorite movie right now. There's Bo Burnham. Um, that's Halsey. I don't know if you guys have heard of her, but she's pretty awesome. There's my living room TV, which is like super nice that I love a whole lot. Um, there is g -E -Z, the love of my life. Um, I thought this was really cool. I set up a map of the U.S. and this is everywhere I've been. So basically I've been to Texas. Um, here is just a little thing, just the different books like Egghead, um, just like little different list taking books. There's me and Bo Burnham. There's me and my friend Ian. And then my mom talked me into getting this Zen garden so like if I don't feel right I can like play in this like it's this tiny little garden I don't know it's for Zen or something and it's my coffee table those are awesome little bar stools here's my bar fruit um, here's my stove which I don't do anything with Lana Del Rey this all sorts of stuff. Here's my Keurig, my microwave, all this fun little stuff everywhere. I actually do need to do dishes. Um, let's see. Pretty stocked up on food. Like super stocked up on food for one person, so I'll not go hungry. Here's this. Let's see. Here's my bathroom. There's me! Thug life to remember where I come from. We film, we edit, we film again, assuming there's free food and coffee. 
There's goodbye sadness, hello jokes. There's a scale for when I want to feel horrible about myself. Here's my shower curtain. Looks like a girl threw up in there with all of the like lotion and body products. Um, this is my compartment, which I should keep a slide on. It's not as organized as it was, but this is where I keep all of my shoes. Yeah, I'm kind of like a shoe addict. Here's my pantry, which is also stocked up. I wish food just didn't go bad, because like then I'd be like set for like months. Here's my washer and dryer room. It's a tiny little like closet. This is where I keep all of my honest stuff, my costume stuff. Um, that's a gift from Cullen. Wow, we're gonna close that door. There's G Easy again. We can turn this light on. There's laundry baskets for laundry. G Easy. There's Lynn Manuel as Alexander Hamilton. This is my room. There's a rent poster which is totally crooked up there. And this is uh that's Halsey, Grumpy Cat. Here's um kind of all my movies and stuff. My TV. I pretty much have like nothing but like Degrassi episodes. It's kind of ridiculous. Um, here's all of my makeup. And yes, I use like a little bit of everything, believe it or not. Um, my jewelry, which I still haven't really unpacked. My closet, which is organized for the first time ever. It's pretty, pretty cool. And there's just some stuff I gotta unload jacket and stuff. Here's the side of my table. These are some of my favorite pictures. Here's me and my grandpa when I was four at a movie star themed birthday party and that was me and him at it. There's a little poem reading um, thing Cullen got me. So yeah, this is my room. And I have like these cool little blinds that are kind of wacky but we're gonna close that. So yeah, this is my this is my new home, guys. This is it. I'm sure you guys are probably wondering how I'm kind of feeling about everything. Um, and it's uh, well, my mom left yesterday, and I've already made one new friend, which is really cool. And he's this like really hot Italian guy, uh, and he was fun. Because uh, if you know me, you know that I love, like, the Italian culture. It's, like, my favorite. Um, he was really fun, and he's actually from Long Island, so um, I'm making friends. I start orientation for class and everything next week, which will be really cool. And then I go to Las Vegas next weekend, and I just have a bunch. And I'm hoping somebody will be going to Disneyland with me because... I really want to go to Disneyland. I feel like that'd be a lot of fun. And um, I'm also going to a g -E concert on Mardi Gras, which is February 9th um, here in LA. And as of right now, a very special YouTuber will be joining me, which I hope you guys know who she is because I'm sure you do. She's awesome. And uh, we're going to collaborate. So you guys comment below and guess who's going to be going to the g -E concert with me. Also, um, I have set up a new P.O. box for me here. So that P.O. box is right there you can just mail whatever like no limit on package size or anything like that because if it's too big like I'll still get it um, but make sure that you put the right number on the actual P.O. box thing so my P.O. box number is 169 so you have to make sure you put that because if you don't they'll send the mail back so um, also another thing Morgan did actually take over the P.O. box that I had back home so if anybody wants to keep sending mail that way you can you can just write Morgan Ball in the address but if you put my name on there it'll still go to the same P.O. box so it's all good. Thank you guys for watching um, go check out my second channel where I do vlogs and story time and stuff like that um, I haven't posted on that channel for the past two weeks because things have been like really chaotic with the move and everything like that but I hope you guys really enjoy this video and like my new place as much as I do and also 
also this is a little plug for my friend Josh who was Prince Philip in a video with me recently um, he is starting to do Disney princes on his main channel so you need to go check that out um, it's really funny he's hilarious he's like one of the funniest people I know at Tattletales which is his YouTube channel and other than that I think that's it thank you guys so much for watching bye